guys, uh, Justin over here at Zombie Certified. We're here with Seth uh, from The Walking Dead, also known as The Priest. Uh, if you, a lot of y'all don't know. Um, I want to go ahead and ask you a couple questions. Uh, first of all, really, how are you? I'm pretty good. I'm yeah? pretty good. It's my first time in San Antonio. There you go. Having a blast. Nice, nice. Uh, when did you did you fly in recently? I flew in from New York last night. No, last night? Last night. I went by the, um, the Alamo this morning. I didn't go inside the actual building. <laughs> I was walking around the paths, which was kind of cool. Yeah. Some people tell me I need to go and see it at night because it's all lit up in a really spectacular It is. Way. It's very beautiful. Uh, check out the Riverwalk. The Riverwalk. Uh, I did a little walk. It was, it was cold here, man. I mean, we getting hit with a snowstorm in New York this weekend, <laughs> but I was looking to like 70 degrees Texas weather and it was like 40 something. We're hoping for that too, but uh, that cold front came in and uh, yeah, this weather is just dead for us. It's, okay. it's just way too cold. So, uh, of course, I know that you can't ask, uh, answer a lot of the things from The Walking Dead. So um, <laughs> um, but with your character as uh, the priest in the, in the Walking Dead. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I know you more from Starship Troopers. Uh, yeah. that, that's, that's, you're my character in that one. That, yeah. was, that was just epic. So, do you feel yourself in, if uh, a zombie apocalypse would actually happen, do you think you would be more the priest or Starship Trooper? Um, I have a lot of um, <laughs> a lot of pent-up rage. I would think I'd be close to a Starship Trooper. There you go. Star there you go. Oh, yeah. oh, that'd be that'd be epic. Yeah. That'd be epic. Um, now, with all the characters that are still alive in The Walking Dead, mm -hmm. who do you think needs to stay alive um, in The Walking Dead to, to help out the group more? I think Rick is a must. I think I think Carl also needs to stay alive. I think. Um, you know, I don't know how closely they're following the, the, the comics because I don't read the comics. No. You know, but I think if uh, if Carl were to die, I think that would also be the death of Rick, and the death of Rick would be a leaderless group, and a leaderless group is is one it's, that's just zombie fodder. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, I guess. Uh, have you ever seen Zombieland? I have not. Okay, so in Zombieland, there's a character named Tallahassee, mm -hmm. and throughout his adventures uh, throughout the country, he's always looking for a snack. He's always looking for Twinkies. Okay. What would be your go-to Twinkie or snack? <laughs> mm. Mm. It would either have to be M&M's plain, because I'm <laughs> allergic to nuts, though almonds, I can't eat almonds, and I do enjoy almonds, Ooh. or Hershey's bar with almonds. There you go, Hershey's there you go. Hershey's bars with almonds or M&M's plain, so there's your free plug, Hershey's <laughs> and M&M Mars com Company. Just don't eat Hershey's in front of Herschel. You know, no, that would not be good. That would not be good. Sure. So, guys, remember, check out Zombie Certified. There you go. Thank you. All right. Hey, man. Cheers, Thank man. you. All Thank right. you.